Thomas, Thomas and, and the, the pigs. Choo choo. There are lots and lots of farms on the island of Soda. There are farms with sheep. There are farms with cows. There are farms with ghosts. Thomas likes visiting all the farms. But his favorite farm is all the farm on Trotter's Pig Farm. Thomas likes the curly tails and the funny noises they make. Oink, 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 oink. Thomas likes to visit Farmer Trotter's Pig Farm as often as he could. One day, Thomas was watching the pigs roll in the mud. Farmer Trotter was happy to see Thomas. Hello, Farmer Trotter. Hello, Hello, Thomas. I have some very, I have some very special, special news. One of my, One of my pigs is going, going to have piglets today. today. Thomas, was, Thomas excited. was excited. I can't wait to I see them. I need some soft swab for the piglets. I'd like you to go to Farmer right McCall's right collected. now to collect it. He will be waiting for you. Thomas was happy to help. Yes, Farmer Trotter. So Thomas has cheerfully away with his empty flatbed. I was ready to find him with holes. Thomas thought about the pigs. I'm sure the pigs will like the soft swab. I wonder if there was anything else they would like. Thomas puffed up to the dairy. He saw Percy. Thomas told Percy all about the piglets. How exciting. I wish I could see them. But I have to deliver this milk. Thomas looked at the milk tun and I see it uh, flew into his funnel. I'm sure the piglets will like some milk. May I have some? Of course you can, Thomas. So the milk so turns were loaded onto Thomas's, Thomas's flatbed. Thank you, Percy. Thank you, Percy. I must go. Farmer McCall, McCall is waiting for me. And he steamed away. And he steamed away. So Thomas felt really pleased. I wonder what else the pig was my life. Then Thomas saw James. James was at an orchard. James was at an orchard. The trees were full of juicy red apples. Hello, James. Hello, Thomas. Thomas told James all about the piglets. The piglets will soon be born, said Thomas. I must collect some soft straw for them. I wish I could see the piglets, but I have to deliver these boxes of apples to the village, said James. Thomas looked at the juicy red apples. I'm sure the piglets will like some juicy red apples. May I have some? Of course you can. So, Thomas' so, flatbed was loaded with lots, lots, of, juicy lots of juicy red apples. Thank you, James. Thank you, I must go. From McCall is waiting for me. Thomas put two for your way. He felt very pleased. I wonder what else the piglets might like. Then Thomas saw some children. They were collecting shiny brown chestnuts. Hello, Thomas. Hello, Thomas. Hello. Thomas told the children, Thomas told the children all, about the all about the piglets. They were very excited. They were very excited. <laughs> I'm sure the piglets will like some shiny brown chestnuts to eat. Please, may I have some for them? The children were delighted did to give Thomas some of the shiny brown chestnuts. Thank you, I must go. Farmer McCall was waiting for me. And Thomas puffed away. He felt even more pleased. At last, Thomas puffed his Farmer McCall's farm. Farmer McCall was waiting. He was cross. Thomas, you're late. Where have you been? I'm sorry, Farmer McCall. I stopped to collect some milk, some juicy red apples, and some shiny brown chestnuts for the piglets. Farmer McCall looked at Thomas's flatbed. 
milk. He's out the milk. The juicy, the juicy red with apples, apples and shiny brown chestnuts. Your flat, your flat, bed, your flat is bed is full. You have no room for a swallow now. now. There's one fire boxes. I didn't think about, didn't think about that. that. I hope the piglets will like the milk, the apples, and the chestnuts. Just as much as just so. I must pass sleep back to farmer Trotters. The piglets will be born soon. So Thomas pumped his pistons and puffed cheerfully away. Tom pulled up at the farm. Farmer Trotter was waiting. He looked at Thomas's full flat bed. He was surprised. Thomas, where's the soft swaw? I thought the piglets were like he thinks that's a mess of swaw. No, Thomas. Piglets need soft swaw. And they're about to be born. Thomas felt very silly. I'm sorry. I'll empty my flat bed. Then I'll pop back to farm my coals as fast as I can. I must get the swap. There will be no delay. The piglets will be needed by the end of the day. Thomas saw Percy at the water tower. Thomas, I know something else the piglets will like. I'm sorry, Percy. I can't stop. Bye, Thomas. I must get the swap. There will be no delay. I have no time for chatter along the way. Next, Tom saw James at the junction. Hello, Thomas. I've been thinking about the piglets. I'm sure they like. I'm sorry, James. I can't stop. I must get the swab. There'll be no way. I have no shadow along the way. Thomas wished and he wished. He huffed and he puffed until he arrived at Farmer McCall's farm. It was late. Hello, Farmer McCall. Now I have plenty of room for the soft swab for the piglets. Can you roll it right now? Of course I can, Thomas. Thank you, Farmer McCall. I must hurry. Thomas is pissed and pumped, and his axles ache. I must pop back. There is no time for delay. The piglets need to swap by the end of the day. At last, Thomas arrived at Father Farmer Clark. Uh, it was now nearly night time. Thomas thought that the pigs were gone. Cinders and ashes. I'm too late. You're just in time, Thomas. I need that soft swab right away. Farmer Trotter unloaded the swab from Thomas's flat bed. And he took it away to make a nice soft bed for the piglets. The piglets have just been born. Thomas was delighted. Bubble and boilers, look how small they are. And how sweet. Thomas could see the piglets. Will you like the soft swaw? Uh, that little piglet is looking at me. I think I'll call him Thomas. Thomas was so happy. His axles tingled and his boiler bubbled. Choo-choo.